generations. And now, the power of two restores the one. We got a bidet! Hello everybody and welcome back for another Game Nights with Dyad. Uh, today we are talking about one of our favorite party games and that is Catchphrase. The nice thing is that it's a lot of fun for a very little amount of understanding how to play. There's not, many, there's not much to the rules um, and there's a wide variety of different uh, types of catchphrases you can play. Uh, we have you know, the original one here, uh, but there's also some fun themes where you can get even Star Wars for example. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and show you what you need to know for assembly, which is very little uh, setup and how to play. So let's get started. All right, so we're going to focus on the assembly really quick. Again, there's not much to it. All there is is turning it over, unscrewing the screw, and putting in your batteries. Uh, I believe it is three triple A's. You might want to double check with your device because they have evolved over the years. Um, but once you have your batteries in there, go ahead and screw the screw in the back back in and then you are ready to play. Okay, now we're moving on to the setup for the game. Now you want to keep in mind how many players you have. Uh, if you have an even number of players, you want to go every other for the players that are on their own team. So if you have team A and team B, you want to be sitting A, B, A, B, so on and so forth. If you have an odd number of players, you want only one pair of people on the team with the odd number to sit next to each other. That way you can remember to take turns of passing between the players appropriately. They will have to alternate. Uh, other than that, the way you turn the game on is by hitting go, and then we are ready to, to talk about gameplay. Okay, now how does the game work? Well, uh, the game is built so that there's a ton of different categories. Uh, we already have the game on, uh, so you can see there's that category. You can hit the category button to switch through them. And basically you want to pick the one that you want to start with your team or just talk to your team and see which one you feel the most confident in. Once you've picked the topic, you're going to go ahead and hit go. And then a word or phrase will appear. Now your job is to get your team to go ahead and solve or figure this out based on your clues. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and stop it so it doesn't tick the whole time. Uh, but... Basically, what can you do and what can you not do? What you can do is use hand gestures and do your best to describe what it is. What you cannot do is you cannot say it rhymes with this, it starts with that, uh, and you cannot say, so for example, if it was uh, lightsaber, because I love Star Wars, uh, you cannot say it is light something. It cannot be anything associated with the word itself. If you do mess up and you accidentally say part of it or say rhymes with whatever, you immediately stop the game and give the other team a point. So try to refrain from that. Uh, if your team gets it correct, what you do is you hit next and pass it off to the next person. Once the game itself goes off, you'll hear a beeping noise like an alarm. Whoever is holding it, that team is the loser for the round and the other team gets a point. Now, the team that was holding it, they have to see if the opposing team can guess what your word was. And if they do, they get a bonus point. How do you award points? Well, you just hit the team number and it adds to the team total. The last thing to talk about is how do you win? First one to seven points. First one to seven points wins and the game is over. All right. Now we all know how to do the assembly, do the setup, and play the game of catchphrase. 
Again, it's a lot of fun, especially if you have a fun group to play with, uh, and it works for even and odd numbers. You just have to remember those small rules uh, and strategies that we talked about to take care of that. Uh, if you enjoyed this type of video, make sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications. This is one of the new things we're trying to do, is to start some game nights with Dyad and share uh, some of our favorite games with all of you. Drops a like if you liked the video, and drops a comment letting us know if you have any questions about Catchphrase. And then, as always, everybody, thank you for watching. We'll see you next time.